What is up guys, it's Sobash, welcome back. We are back with some more Mobile Legends news and updates and I am about to bring you some first content on Hilda. We're gonna take a look at her abilities and see exactly what she is going to be bringing. Of course, Hilda is labeled as a fighter and a tank. It's really weird, uh, kind of combination of both, I guess. I uh, really wasn't expecting that, but from her abilities, and the look of her, yeah, you could tell she was going to be labeled, you know, either one of them, but they labeled her both of them. So, let's actually take a look at her abilities and what she actually is capable of doing. Her passive ability is Blessing of Wilderness. Hilda's HP regen speed increases when she's in the bush. Entering the bush will give her a shield that absorbs an amount of damage equal to 10% of her max HP lasting 5 seconds. This effect can only be triggered every 10 seconds. When Hilda's HP drops lower than 25%, she can obtain a great HP regen ability. This effect can only be triggered every 120 seconds. Alright, so her HP regen increases when she's in the bush. So when she hides in a bush, she gets faster regen. Uh, entering the bush will give her a shield that absorbs an amount of damage equal to 10% or her ma of her max HP. So she gets a shield on top of that. Not only does it regen, she's getting a shield. This effect can only be triggered every 10 seconds. So I'm assuming that's the shield that can be affected. Uh, and then the 25% uh, regen, that's only triggerable every 120 seconds, which is every two minutes. Basically, that's her saving point for not dying, I guess. All right, her uh, next ability is Combat Ritual. Activates the Great Sword's rune power, increasing Hilda's own movement speed by 30% for three seconds. Additionally, this will increase the damage dealt next to basic attacks by 200 points of physical damage to the target, and it slows it down. The enemy behind the target will receive 120 points of physical damage. Uh, so it's a basic two-part skill. Uh, the first time you hit it, it's going to increase your speed by 30% for three seconds. Uh, and it also will do basic damage to them if you hit it again, it looks like. So uh, that's a pretty unique skill as well. Moving to the next one, Art of Hunting. Locks onto one enemy target for pursuit. Skill can be released three times maximum. The second attack will deal damage to target surrounding. Third attack will knock back target and surrounding enemies temporarily, each time dealing 120 points of physical damage. Now that is really interesting. So the skill can be released three times at maximum. I'm not really sure what that means. Uh, the second attack will deal damage to the target surroundings. Of course, that's AOE damage. The third will knock the back the target enemies and everyone around it, and it deals damage. Uh, so both of her abilities so far have been AOE damaging abilities. Uh, really unique. Uh, not very many characters have abilities where all of them are AOE. Uh, it's really good, especially for a fighter and a tank. Uh, and her ultimate, which I'm assuming this is the ultimate power of will wildness, Hilda jumps toward the target and slashes powerfully, dealing 700 points of physical damage to the target and temporarily stuns the target, at the same time dealing 420 points of physical damage to enemy units surrounding the target. Each kill or assist will increase the power of wildness and increase the skill's physical damage by 40%, by, by 40 points, not 40%, I'm sorry, up to 10 layers maximum. Once the maximum layer is reached, damage to enemies will further increase by 80 points. Uh, so, of course, that ultimate does include a stun. It's not a trapping effect like we were speculating about. But this is the basic overall gist of what we're going to be looking at with Hilda. And, of course, you can see the skin is there as well. Uh, the cost being 24,000 battle points or 349 diamonds for Hilda. Um, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Um, if you're looking forward to seeing some gameplay on this character, stay tuned. We're going to be live streaming probably directly after this video. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you are subscribed and notifications are turned on so you can catch that live stream. As always, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.